God the Father, the famine, which will grip the world as the third seal is opened, will not be confined to the lack of food. Monday, March 24, 2014 at 3.33 p.m. My dearest daughter, the famine, which will grip the world as the third seal is opened, will not be confined to the lack of food for the body. The famine I speak of will be starvation of the spirit, as every trace of the truth will be erased by the enemies who infiltrate the church, created on earth by my Son, Jesus Christ, in union with his body. Soon, the truth will become confusing and the Holy Spirit will be replaced by the spirit of evil. Those who will spread the new form of false evangelization will be responsible for withholding the food of life from my children. When you are starved of the truth, you will have little to nourish your soul and then, in time, you will fall into paganism. I am intervening in every step of the process by which you will be led into error. Every effort will be made by me and I will, through my son's mercy, bring many of his sacred servants the graces they need to discern truth from fiction. As I draw you away from the enemy, many of you will find it difficult to remain true to the word of God. You will be tormented by doubts, lack of courage to adhere to the Holy Word and a terror of being declared a traitor to the Church. The battle for souls will be as intense, as it was during my son's time on earth. The greatest difficulty will be brought about because of the failure on the part of my son's holy servants to detect deceit within their own ranks. And so, they will, because of their lukewarm faith and lack of discernment, lead many of their fellow clergy into serious error, as foretold. I declare to you that time is short. There will not be accorded to you the time needed to draw all of my children into the merciful arms of my Son. To those of you who are privileged to have been given the grace to acknowledge the gift of the Book of Truth, much will, therefore, be expected of you. Through your faith and trust in me, your beloved Father, you will help to lead my children back, so that they will readily accept the intervention of the warning, when my Son embraces the world within the rays of his great mercy. Those times are upon you and it is time to take up your armor and fight for the true word, the truth, to be retained. Without the truth there is no life. Your Father. God the Most High.